Good morning, welcome to Thailand. A product video. Go 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 Sport have made some golf gloves. They're getting into that market as well. They are expanding and they sent me two of them to bring out here and have a little test of. They're fully synthetic, they're breathable, they're moisture wicking. But Thailand is where golf gloves come to die with the humidity, the sweating, and when you handle a cold drink covered in condensation and you forget you've still got your glove on. It is not uncommon out here to change gloves every four holes. Now I've brought out here over 15 years many different gloves trying to find one that will actually go 18 holes. And the only one I've managed to find uh, is a full leather product from my favourite company. Some of the other companies fall somewhat short when it comes to this weather. So tomorrow at Lam Shebang, turn it the right way around, this is going to be my glove of choice. And we'll see how it stacks up against the biggest names in the business. So there's the beastie right there. We had a little fun over email trying to sort out my size. Nice big Velcro patch. Nice tight fitting. And um, it fits like a glove. You know when you put a new glove on and you flex your fingers and it's got that nice tightness to it. Yeah, I quite like this. The question is, will this survive the weather? Lam Shabang, tomorrow. Will it live? Will it die? Just a few shots coming up. Now you don't hit shots like this. Now land on the green. If you have any doubt, Great shot. And a glove on Good your on. hand. I could hit this with complete confidence, knowing that it's not going to slip. At no Good point shot. throughout this day did it get wet or damp, which is more than you can say for my shirt. But you don't take apart par fives unless the grip you have on the club is pretty decent and you certainly don't have chips for eagles when the club is slipping in your hand. I've lost my fair share of golf balls in Thailand with a glove that's just let go at the wrong moment. I mean look at this jungle on the right jungle in front, sand, you need total confidence and this glove gave me that total confidence. Driving over the top of some fairway bunkers in the distance, again you can only do this when you got a good grip of that club. And then knocking in a nine iron under the hole, uphill putt for a bird. Okay, uphill putt. Finally, a drive, a long drive over water, avoiding the sand on the left and the trees on the right. Ooh, good shot. Yeah. <laughs> One, two, three. Thank you. Come here. Come here. Right, the day is over. Let's get to the meat and bones of this relatively short video. Go Go Sport V Pro Synthetic Glove. I've been out here with lots of gloves over 15 years. And as I say, the only one that has managed to pass the humidity, the sweat test, the picking up your drink covered in condensation with your gloved hand by mistake is my uh, favourite brand. 
many others have failed, especially the synthetics. They seem to soak up the moisture. Next thing you know is your hand slipped with your driver and your ball's carving off and into the water and you think, damn it, I should have changed my glove. Four or five holes is the absolute max. I've played all 18 with this today. It's got a few, few black marks from my grip because I've got brand new grips. I always put brand new grips on to come out here. It hasn't lost its elasticity. It hasn't lost its shape. It's still really nice and tight. But at no point today did this ever feel wet or damp. Even when I did grab me a bottle of drink with the wrong hand, I thought, oh, damn it, what have you done? I'm mightily impressed, especially as we sized it over the internet. They sent me a size chart. I had to get a tape measure out, measure my hand, measure my fingers. Now, as you can see, there's a little bit of loose on the end of my thumb because my mother was five feet tall at best and I've got her tiny little hands. So all my gloves always have a little bit of extra on the end of the fingers. But all the same, it wasn't inconvenient today. It's as dry as a bone. I am absolutely mightily impressed with this. Now we're not sure yet what they're gonna price it at, probably somewhere in the nine pound region. I don't know how many rounds of golf this will do. I've only done the one so far. But yeah, for a synthetic, which I wasn't expecting to get more than four or five holes out of before I had to put the other one on, because this was sodden, it's done mightily well. Thank you very much. Ta-ra.